Hey gang, I'm Mr. Church, and today we're going to be building this greenhouse together. Lovely, isn't it? Now, this is our, uh, this is our piece, pizza of resistance. Because this pizza is the way we're going to be doing this today without having to use the foundations slash farmable, uh, the, the, the farmable tiles, which you might not have unlocked yet, or you just don't like how they split stuff into quadrants and you can't build certain things and them only crops well we're going to use this method to we're just going to kind of encase the ground in walls basically and so we don't have any foundations you want to get your first starting piece to be as low to the ground as possible in your lowest area because you don't want it to be floating at all so you're going to be snapping these pieces to it and then we're just going to take our wall and snap it to this. And the cute thing is, if uh, you've got the non-stair ones, you can just remove them like this. If you have a staircase there, you won't be able to just take it off. Cause, but if you move uh, this, turn it into a doorway, now you can move this around or delete it or whatever you want with it. It's a glorious time uh, for the USSR. Now, I didn't say that, so we're also going to be just eyeballing it, moving it around, trying to get it as best we can, because uh, this is really the tedious part of it. You're trying to line this up as well as you can, because there's not really a way to snap walls to roofs like you used to be able to, uh, which is how you used to be able to do this method, so we just have to eyeball it, try a thousand times, hope for the best, now I only spent about 15 minutes trying to do this and it was a little crooked you'll see at the end here um, but if you if you spend a little more time with it you can get it pretty pretty dead nuts accurate or, or whatever they call it, whatever they say and then when in there so what you're trying to do is uh, you're just gonna put the wall there like for a second to see how it lines up like this and then adjust as is needed and then once you have it lined up like side to side, front and back, you're going to want to pull it as tight to this wall as you can. Uh, see how it's kind of separate? So you just pull it in as as far as it'll go towards us until it turns red. You know, push it back just slightly. And then that's where you want it. You want to pull them out together as close as you can, as close as fucking possible. Now, uh, once you have that down, you can just again snap a non-stair one to it uh, and then just snap a wall to that and that's pretty easy if you if you work in doorways you can delete everything you don't have to worry about it and then just change it to walls after that I'm gonna speed this process up so you don't have to watch the entirety of my suffering well, you do have to watch the entirety of it, but it won't take 25 years like it took me. This is only wasting a few seconds of your life, rather than a few days. So, you're just going to repeat the process, rinse and repeat, like they say, over and over again. And uh, then, once you've got it all down, just get rid of this completely. Goodbye. And now we've got our little flippin' fucking foop. Just turn it into walls now. Easy as hitting uh, square and triangle or whatever, I don't know, X, Y, Z. You push the buttons, you do the thing. Uh, we're gonna decide which one we want our doorway on. Uh, you want to pick the one that's low to the ground, if, if, uh, or in the lowest part of the ground. If you pick the ones up here, where the, where the ground comes up higher, you won't actually be able to walk through the doorway, unfortunately. Uh, as you can see, my forehead is rubbing uncomfortably against the glass, which is hurting my feelings and my flesh. So we don't need two doorways next to each other. Now we're going to put the roof and uh, bits. See how everything says, no, you can't build it? Throw it on a foundation like I just did then you can build it. It's just a stupid little quirk. You gotta have a foundation somewhere in your camp to be able to put walls and, and things. Uh, because Todd hates you and he wants to take your firstborn son. 
Now you're just gonna clip them, uh, clip the roof peak together with the other roof bits so that there's not a giant gap down the middle uh, because it won't line up perfectly because I suck at this game and only spent a few minutes instead of a few hours lining things up. So uh, you can certainly spend more time so that this part here lines up better, but I sure as hell ain't gonna do that because I, I don't want to. Now we're gonna um, just fill in the rest of these holes here with, um, you know, because for some reason they decided they were gonna put all the glass pieces mixed in with all the rest instead of having them all together like all the other sets. So we get to just go up and down 85 years for each glass piece that we need. All right, this is looking pretty fucking cool. Now we're gonna put some crops in here or put a door on it. Yeah, 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 the door on it. And then we're gonna. Let me see what I can do here. Let's try this. Yeah, that's pretty fucking dumb. I gotta... No. No. Okay. Now let's put crops in it. Corn over here for the whiskey. Mute fruit over here. For the, I don't need that shit. Log, dead bodies on it, in the back, to sit on. Hay bale, fire hazard. Plants, for Mother's Day. Yeah. One, the best part about this is is you can put the Adam Shop stuff, like shrubs inside your greenhouse because for some reason they don't let you put these on farmable tiles I, I don't know why but you can put them in here and that also means you can put the trees and stuff in here you know if you build the ceiling up higher which is just easy to stack walls up to it's higher and then you can have trees inside your little building here it's a good time one other good thing you can do is you can also put your water purifiers in here because it is the ground, so you can build away to your heart's content. I'm not going to bother hooking these up, because this is just a to show you real quick video. So if you want to see a good build video, stay tuned. There will be more coming. Please like, subscribe, whistle at your dog, tell him to come in, it's time for dinner. I'm Mr. Church. Bye.